We have Chilala and his friend who does Mei Hua Quan, two Kung Fu guys, and they went to a kickboxing gym. It's a kickboxing MMA gym, also does Taekwondo. The rules are no elbows and no knees. So let's see how Kung Fu and Chilala and friend do against kickboxers. So this is Mei Hua Quan. Mei Hua Quan throwing the low kicks, now high kicks. That's great. Both of them are kind of thinking about levels, not just kicking one area. You see that so much when like karate guys or taekwondo guys fight, right? So this is pretty cool. It looks like a point system. Woo, that was a high kick by kickboxer. So there's like a kickboxer type. Um, they're counting points. The, the kung fu guys on the left, that's how they're looking at the points. The kickboxer is on the right. That's how they're counting points, if you guys want to know. Um, okay, that punch, I think, counted. So, okay, the moment there's a strike that connects, it counts. Whoo, that was a great spinning back fist. So, um, according to the ref, you can't do a spinning back fist. Man, that's not fair, dude. Okay, um, that. but guys, that's kickboxing, I guess. So... Man, that, that sucks that you can't do a spinning back fist. What happens in a clinch? I guess it's broken up. So. Ooh, there you go. So, that was a great takedown. You are not allowed to take down. Okay, not allowed to take down. So, he, he lost a point because of that. Oh, man, dude. These kung fu guys are showing kickboxing. That kickboxing has... Like a limited skill set, man. This is hilarious. So, it was ruled a draw, even though, even though the the kung fu guy totally won. Um, so I'm gonna title this Silala Wing Chun and Kung Fu Friend Beat Kickboxers. That's what I'm gonna. So, okay, let's look at Silala's Wing Chun. Let's see how he adapts. Oh, that was great. So this is look at that. It's cumulative. If you look up there, Silala is um. Whoa, that was pretty good fake right there. Um, Silala's points are, are added on to what his teammate just did. This is pretty cool. I like this cumulative. Oh, there you go. You, you connect in the face, man. That was good. Oh, that was good. So, someone said nice. Um, wow. Look at the- Ah, oh, you're not allowed to knee. Uh-oh. She's gonna deduct a point, man. She's gonna deduct a point on you. She gonna deduct a point. Oh, you see? Oh. Okay, Chila. Oh, there you go. Dude, Ch Chilala's been in so many matches where he's not allowed to um, elbow a knee, man. I'm sure he can do this. Dude, I'm rooting for the Kung Fu guys here because, like, the, the kickboxing rules are limiting them. This is like, you know, Kung Fu guys always say the kick. Oh, he did a spinning back fist, man, dude. Oh, the, the, the ref didn't see it. Dude, he totally did a spinning back fist and the ref didn't see it. Oh, it's the girls! Okay, so this is one of Chilala's teammates. Um, this is going to be light sparring. Um, the kickboxing girl has a very... Um, uh, what is the word? The kickboxing girl has a, has a reach advantage. Dude, this is not fair, man. Okay. Oh, she's got some Wing Chun in her. It's angle, angle, angle. Don't... Oof. The, the girl, the taller kickboxer girl... Um, Obviously is not used to not used to someone applying pressure. So she's actually having a tough time with this Wing Chun girl. You look at that. You're not allowed to grab the leg. Oh, they deduct another point, man. Dude, this is totally unfair. This is totally unfair, man. Dude, Silala, why would you do this to yourself, man? I guess it's part of Chinese culture. You want to win against unbeatable odds, right? That's Chinese culture. Wow, that's pretty cool. Dude, all these kickboxers are going to be like, oh, uh, we, we should train in some kung fu. So, guys, um, you guys can watch the rest of the video. I'm just breaking down a little part of it. I really want you guys to go support Silala. I love what he's doing. Like, he's basically doing fight quests, but, like, he's a Wing Chun fighter doing fight quests. This is so cool. And we saw three matches. I don't even know what to say because... Half the time, the ref was, like, deducting points because they were doing something that wasn't allowed in kickboxing. So, like, 
I mean, you know, you look at the Kung Fu guy, he has his hands up, right? You can tell he's pressure tested. He at least knows to protect his face. So you look at the kickboxers, right? The kickboxers, their elbows are a little more flared in. So, and then we look at the second match with Silala. Silala, I, you know, that was the spinning back fist that didn't get, um, didn't get caught, but this got deducted points. I mean, I think the next step with this kickboxing place, this shield place, is they need to train with like elbows and knees. And this girl, you know, as much as she was fighting an opponent that was way bigger, she, she tried her best to keep the distance, right? Look at her. She's always like not within striking range. She's going in, trying to blitz out. So it's pretty cool, man. So, guys, um, this was fight commentary breakdowns. Totally rigged, but under the rig system is a draw. And, you know, you, you go to the guy's dojo or the, the this dojo, so you're not going to expect complete fair treatment, right? Okay, um, whatever. Uh, but anyways, I'm going to say the Kung Fu guys won, all right? Uh, fight commentary breakdowns, out.